Cyril Fletcher in the careless sneezer. Scene one, take one. Yes, thank you. This is the tale of Ebenezer, who was a very careless sneezer. Well, Ebby caught a cold one day and nearly sneezed his bench away. He sneezed at poor Penelope Goff, who nearly coughed a rivet off. He sneezed in Daniel Didcot style, which kept him in his bed a while. And all around within a week, each workman had a crimson beak. The manager, an egg-shaped bloke, came up, and this is how he spoke. Now look here, Ebenezer Morgan, because you neglect your nasal organ, because each time you sneeze and sniff and will not use your handkerchief, you cause depletion of our ranks and slow production of the tank. So Ebby said, what's ever day? The old man really seemed quite vexed. It seems a small thing, I suppose, to hold my hanky to my nose. But now I see the harm I drink, I'll always sneeze into the thick. So if in bus or train or car, in fact, no matter where you are, the moral is that careless sneezes delay production and spread diseases. Remember, the British public is not to be sneezed at. <laughs>